Good morning from Pop Century Resort. This is Space Mountain Dave Cantrell. I'm here to give you a short walk this morning to give you a tour around the Pop Century Resort. If you've never stayed here, it is a beautiful resort. And as you can see, as we're looking across Hourglass Lake, you can see the art of an animation. And this morning, I'm going to take you on a little tour around and show you the beauty and the thing of it. And just show you how beautiful it is. Like I said, as you can see, and behind me is where I, what building I was staying in. This is the 70s building. Each building has a theme from each era. In this case, I was in the 70s era, which I remember because growing up in the eras. So as you can see, I'm gonna take a walk. I like the design of everything and it's beautiful. And anybody that remembers the 70, how many remember the eight tracks? The seven, how many remember the eight tracks from the 70s that you stuck in the car, the, the big thick things that were crazy? And what I love about this resort is that as you're walking, it gives you some signs and different things that happen from the 70s, like 76 celebrated the bicentennial of Barbara Walters joined the ABC News to be the first woman to co-host the network news. And again, over there is the Art of Animation as we continue to walk. We're going to walk this way this morning. We're just going to continue to walk around and look at the beauty. I mean, look at this. This is gorgeous. gorgeous and walking and again as you can see they give you more facts and signs and this is the back side this is the back side of the 70s sorry about the glare in the sun guys I'm trying to keep you out of the sun see and they give you facts on both sides from here 1979 and beauty other than that, look at the beautiful glass. How many, again, how many remember the 8-track tapes? And here we go, some more 8-track. The big 8-track tape from the 70s. And of course, and then back over here, we're going to be getting into the 80s and the 90s. That is the courtyard, and we'll walk up through there in a little bit where I can show you some more things. Some of this you saw last night. See, now we're getting into the facts about 84. How many remember the 1984 when we hosted the Los Angeles Olympics? And we ended up winning 83 gold medals that year. Look at that. I may remember the Rebix key from, from the 1980s. Like I said, each building is themed to each different time of year. In this case, this is 19, this is the 1980s area. I mean, as you can see, we're getting into the break dancing and all this stuff so and I love the theme of it and 
And again, this is probably this is the 1980s era where you got the break dancing. And everybody was using the term awesome. Guy, so and just look how beautiful it is. And then this is the pool for this area. I've never been in this area, so this is the first time I've ever been in the 80s. And then look at that good old. Let me get over here where the sun's not into that. Oh, look at that! A big Walkman. That is awesome. Now let me show you this. How many remember Roger Rabbit? That was actually my class master Scott when I graduated in 1989. This is gorgeous. See, got Pac-Man. Look at a beautiful pool that we have here. This is just, oh, look at this. A computer right across the ground. A keyboard. Anybody? Yeah, which has not changed today. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, and then you got a big computer. Obviously, to the max. Radical with all the ghosties. Sorry about the sun glare, but it is a beautiful sunshiny day here at Pop Century Resort. And this is, like I said, we're going into the. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the pool is close to time this time. I don't think they used all this pool. I think they used the main pool at the moment. But that is. Look how beautiful the pool is. And how many remember the floppy disks? Look at that. How many remember the floppy disks? The big gigantic floppy disk. And then you got all your break, then break dancing. And here you got another Rubik's Cube. And obviously you got it keeping it real. And like I said, this is the 80s and the 90s. I'm just gonna take a walk around and all that. There's no music, so I know this won't that. Look at the computer. That is awesome. Look at how beautiful that is. This is so just gonna continue to walk back here. And of course this is your amenities. This is your restroom and your you know they got some washer and dryers in here to close your thing. But look how beautiful these are. Again, each building and this is the 90s building here like I said here we have the 80s building and now we're gonna walk keep walking I'm gonna walk you up over to the station and like I said what I like about it is you, as you're walking you get to see some facts and things like that but it's beautiful and this is what I love doing and again, oh, I hope you're enjoying my videos. Um, I do apologize for some of the videos going, some of the streams, but the phone that I'm using currently is saying I am working on some new technology or a new phone, so that'll be my live streams will be a lot better down the road. But just love looking at the beauty in the streams. So. This is gorgeous. I mean, if you take a look back there, it is gorgeous. See, my favorite word. There it goes. I love this part. I love the word. Some of the words that they have. I mean, just the decor on some of these buildings that you can see. I can't, I don't know if you can really see, but it says 
gnarly day up there. Anybody ever use the word, phrase word up? Gnarly. Let's do lunch. Kind of hard to see between the trees, but you get the point. It's beautiful. This is a, it's one of the more of the model resorts now, especially since they added the, the thing. I mean, look at that word. This used to be my word, favorite word, that many years ago. Duh. Love it. I just love the theming of the buildings. The color and the themes match each thing, and it's just gorgeous. So now let's just take a walk, and I'm gonna walk you over towards the Skyliner and walk up, walk you towards some of the thing, building. Again, this is part, this is part two. Uh, of the video that will be last night. The first part was a short night walk. So as we're walking, we're just gonna keep looking at the beauty and I'm gonna walk you up to the thing. And if I get a chance, we're gonna walk you to Mr. Potato and Mrs. Potato Head. How many remember Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head? And then I'm gonna, obviously I'm gonna take some pictures. This is awesome as we continue to work again. This is, I'm gonna be walking around the Hourglass Lake. Take and show you, take and show you up of the thing. And we're back in again. This is the 80s and 90s building. And again, you can see that not only do they match the, the toys of the area, but again, they, they match the words to the, they match the words to the theming of the building, which is nice. And then like I said, if you take a look at the thing, they give these little facts about, like 1980, the Little Mermaid swims into theaters, Disney MGM Studios opens up at Walt Disney World. Hey, and yeah, no, it's all good. And of course, who doesn't love and of course, I can't show you because I now have kids coming there. And obviously, that's going to be. Okay. some of this other stuff. I promise you we'll come back to Mr. Yeah, we might be able to get Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head. But, and as you can see, if you can see there's Mr. and Mr. There's Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head. But we're going to walk up the middle and we're going to walk up the building and we'll walk towards that. Because as you can see, Again, this is the area I stayed in. It is quite gorgeous. This is the 80 steam building. Or the 70 steam building. See the hustle? The, the hustle. <laughs> oh boy. All that time when all, all your clothing was made out of polyester. How many remember the polyester? That was ridiculous. In. You see 
seen some of this on last month's video, but now you get to see it during the day when it's a beautiful sunshiny day. There's the big wheel. And we all know what this is. Anybody know what this is? It's foosball. And then look at that. Mickey Mouse with the big telephone Mickey Mouse. So. So here we go. I'm gonna walk through the middle of the foosball. And we're gonna try to walk up front. Take some pictures of everything. They get they look at it. Get down. Polyester. It's just awesome. Again, I love the matching of the theme. This is the 70s theme where we stayed. I stayed over, won't show you which room I stayed in or the building, but the thing they even have little some what's nice is they have some even little they even have a twister game in the area that's what that is oh nice look at that game for the kids to play twister spin the wheel play it all the big rigs back in those days many a times i remember playing twister which is awesome so this is thing and here we go and of course how many remember the Duncan yo-yos and you got a old sports car and we all know who that is with sports goofy remember the original cartoon Awesome. But now we're gonna then, like I said I apologize about some of the things there. Um see there's a big if I can get a better thing, big A track. And then we walk up to it. Well uh, see, big Duncan Yo Yo. This is the main building. We can get food and all the things. Just can't go. I mean, I've stayed here before. It is a gorgeous resort, you know. And when you can catch good deals on it, it really is a nice place to stay. And look at just the beauty of the thing. And you see, 70, 80, 90, 70. And you got the pop scent, pop resort. Eventually, take you down here and show you the pool. There's a small tiki bar. I like it. Uh, I, now this pool will be open later. There it is. Here we are in the uh, 60s. This is just awesome. See, there's another Duncan. And as we walk this way, we'll take you. Tell you what, we're going to walk you through the main building at the moment. There's a little refreshment thing. <laughs> Flower power. Good old 60s. Yeah, definitely before my time. I was definitely a polyester 70s kid, teenage in the 80s. I have to be careful in here, but we'll try to show you the decor around here. I'm gonna. Here we. Here's where the fat, that will be the arcade game. And I'll show you the theming in here. This is the front lobby. Top century. I mean, obviously, you're taking a look at the nostalgic things of the time. 
which is nice. That's the front uh, This is awesome. And we got some seating. Oh, look at this. Oh my goodness. How many of us remember the hard, small computers, the digital phones, the original? Look up there in the corner. Original car phones and cell phones. Oh my goodness. Uh, the original camcorders. I know it's hard to see. Me. Sorry about, apologize about the glare. But look at this. Look at all the songs. Elton John, Madonna, top Michael Jackson, Tina Turner. We're talking some major nostalgia here, people. Then you got all the 70s, different strokes, family feud game. I mean, you're some stuff on here that you just don't see anymore. Look, Wonder Woman. Oh, look at that. Wheel of Fortune. These were some of the earlier games in the 70s and the 80s. It really is. It's just, it's just gorgeous on some of the nostalgia. Is that the original Simon says? Look, look at that. There's a smaller big wheel. That's the one you can ride. Don't think you can ride the one that's out there. But that, but this is gorgeous. And you get the idea. We're just going to walk, slowly walk through here so you can see some of this. I love it. This is gorgeous. This is good. Look at that. I'm telling you, original 60 TV and radio. All right. And of course, you have everything pop. That's where your store is and thing like that. Your eating restaurant. That's your shopping and dining right there. Won't take you in there today. Maybe I'll do our shopping thing. But we're gonna just take a tour of the resort. I'm gonna walk down by the 80s, 90s, walk towards the, I think towards the 60s a little bit. I mean, I'm pointing you guys down or up a little bit because I'm trying to avoid getting anybody on the camera. Um, like I said, we're gonna have some fun. We're gonna walk around. I know my building is that way. We're gonna walk towards the thing. Now, like I said, the pool is beautiful. This is the main pool. Um, but things like that. Right now. We're going to take a look. This is the 60 section. And if, as you can see, you dig it. Like I said, there's the Duncan Yo-Yo and all that. And as you, can, as you look here, got that. And again, cool. And how many don't remember these guys? Flower power oh. from the 60s. Anybody that knows remembers the 60s knows what that's like. But that's, like I said, that was before my time. But I do know anybody that loves Disney knows who those characters are. Baloo and Mowgli from the Jungle original Jungle Book. That is awesome. And then you got the kiddie pool over here. This is more your waiting kid for your little kids here. Which I think is awesome. It's, yeah, it's, that's more of your waiting pool for your kids. And again, it's the 60s. And of course, yeah, I got your play though. Yeah, I've got your Play-Doh. But 
now we're going to walk through here and I'm going to come take some pictures of some of this stuff but I think I'm going to end the tour and then come take some pictures we're going to end up near the Skyliner which is good and I can come take some pictures of some things that I need and we're going to be back because I do got some other things I need to do before I go I do go home today but here's another green wall as you can see big yo-yo and as you can see from the distance actually if you catch it you'll see the skyline of the hand it yeah what I like about it good and I will tell you that what I like about these resorts is if you do like to if you are running in that you got some running trails it shows you some running trails all that and then, you know this is your skyliner boarding and today though the skyliner is not running today because they are doing a thing you can see that it is that is the skyliner but now I'm they are doing some they are doing some testing on it and maintenance so the Skyliner for the Pop Century and the Art Animation is just being tested and doing some main, regular maintenance on it. So, but look how gorgeous that is. That is gorgeous. All right. Well, I'm going to tell you what, guys. That's going to be the end of the tour for today. This is Space Mountain Dave Cantrell. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Tell YouTube that you like the video, how much you like it. And if you want to see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification because you will get more. It'll let, re notify you of when more videos or when I go live streaming which <clears throat> I promise the live streams will get better because I'm working on getting some better equipment. So, for the magical world of the Disney theme parks, wish upon a star, may your dream come true. Bye-bye. This is Space Mountain Dave Cantra. I hope you enjoyed the video from Pop Century Resort. If you enjoyed it, please share it out. Hit the like button. Let YouTube know how much you enjoyed the thing. Leave a comment. Let me know how, whether you liked the video or whether you didn't. Or maybe you have a tip on how I can do it better. Um, come check it out at Space Mountain Dave Cantrell on YouTube. If you liked what you saw, please hit the subscribe button. And hit the bell notification so that you'll get the notifications when the videos come out. I hope you all have a magical day from the world of the Disney theme parks. May you wish upon a star and your dreams come true. Have a magical day. Bye-bye.